This is a murder scene. A dumpster in a back parking lot at a strip mall on West Irving Boulevard. And police say this is surveillance video of the suspect and his victim. I can tell you with all certainty that the walk that he did was, was north on the walkway right here. Irving police say it happened the night of February 26th. A man walks past the camera with a three-year-old pit bull mix on a leash. It's the surveillance camera at the front door of a dentist's office. This is the exact location and the direction the suspect was walking past a dental office, and that's the very location of the security camera that captured him. Police believe he may have rounded this corner and walked this pathway between two buildings until he reached a parking lot at the back of the strip mall. Then police say in this back parking lot, he tied the dog to this blue dumpster and stabbed it to death. But there are security cameras back here too. He actually commits the crime and then th and, and I think comes back and forth a few times. He actually goes back to either watch it, check on it, something. So he spends quite a while. An hour and 15 minutes later, the same camera captures the suspect walking away without the dog and this time with his sweatshirt sleeves pushed up to his elbows. The dog was stabbed multiple, multiple times and police are understandably concerned. You know, is, is this a one-time thing or, or is this just somebody's disturbing pastime? They need the public's help to identify him, an Hispanic male about five foot eight, maybe between 40 and 50 years old. And they want to find him before something else happens, maybe something even worse. Kind of a cold, calculated manner in which this was done. And so that, that's one of our greatest concerns is that, is that what, what was the motive behind this? Has this person done this before? And then is this person of such a mindset that would they try this on a person? And so really need to get this guy identified and get him in, in, into custody.